Hi, in this video we're going to show you how you could add some additional background desktop wallpapers to Windows for free. Alright, so you probably know if you right click on your desktop, you could go to Personalize. Then you have some themes here and you could change your background. If you want to do a picture or the window spotlight or a slideshow from files on your computer. But you're limited as to what photos you could use unless you use your own custom photo, of course. Alright, so what we're going to do is go to the Microsoft Dot design website here and they have a bunch of wallpapers so you can see you can scroll down they have some themed ones here for the uh, Windows Insider program 10 year anniversary they got their Microsoft Pride create and so on it's kind of weird how they make the picture so big but what you could do let's say you want to try these out you'll click on it and it'll give you a zip file with a bunch of pictures for that one at least some of them might notice like this one here actually just shows you the picture then you could right click it and save it and then set your desktop from there so let's try one of these uh, other ones here let's see all right let's try maybe these so you just download the zip file Okay, so that's done. So you can just extract it wherever you like. You can rename the folder. So then you can see once you unzip the zip file, it has a bunch of background images you could use. And you could right click on one, set as desktop background. And of course, you could browse to it from the usual way that you set your background. So if you are going to use these, you might want to move the files maybe to your pictures folder because if you leave them somewhere and then you move them, uh, it might affect whether the background stays working or not because it won't be able to find the file. And then of course, you know, you could just go through all these and, and try whatever ones you like. And most likely these are going to change. So don't expect to see the same ones depending on when you're watching this video. All right, so I'll put a link in the description where you can come download these Microsoft wallpapers and then you can try them out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.